All right, guys, this is episode number 139, 139 videos since February. In this episode, I'm going to open up three boxes of Panini Prism. These were found on a Target website. You had to use your Target red card to purchase these, and there's a limit of three. Um, I tried going on a week later, but they're strict with three boxes per red card, and I think it was an online-only exclusive, at least for these certain blasters that they allocated. Here's what you're looking for. Beyond the base rookies with the prisms and the parallels there, there's a cool insert set, kind of like downtown. They're called Campus, on campus. So here's two that I found interesting. So we got a Russell Wilson in the Badger uniform and then a Trevor Lawrence. That those were the two that stood out as being cool. So they're super short printed. Not expecting to get one, but that would be a insert that would make me jump up and down off camera if I got. So in this, there's a huge group of quarterbacks that you're looking for. Now, that happens a lot with NFL. You have about 10 rookie quarterbacks that it's kind of a guessing game on who's going to pop, who's the one to invest in. Last year, it was really Joe Burrow was the, the one in the early gates that was taking the lead. And then Justin Herbert did really well his rookie year. And they got Jalen Hurts, and Tua kind of came up a little bit late. So it's hard to, before the season start, to pick a core rookie quarterback and kind of go with that. That's really, really hard to do. As of right now, Zach Wilson's one of the top five. You also have Trevor Lawrence, of course. It's hard to tell. You know, looking back at last year, I, I sold a lot of my Justin Herbert rookies. I didn't have a whole lot. I'm not going to say I had a whole bunch of high-end cards of him. I didn't. But I sold some of the Justin Herbert rookies that I had because I thought that the market wasn't going to get a whole lot better on Justin Herbert, at least for the, the rookies that I had. So I sold them off. Obviously, like a second year, Justin Jefferson. After this box, I will put the greens in a pile, and we'll kind of go from there to kind of sort them out. Well, the Crusade, I think it's a 200 card set. I think there's 15 to 20 Crusade, and then 15 to 20 of the All-Americans there. Looks like we're seeing about one green parallel per pack. Don't have a whole lot of value. The Prism base, and obviously when the, the NFL product comes out for Prism, these go down a lot in value because people are more interested in seeing them in a NFL uniform. I feel like the college draft I don't know. I, I like seeing a college uniform, especially if a player gets traded, like DeAndre Hopkins. Obviously, his rookie card is not Arizona, but when you see a rookie of him in his college uniform, that's always going to stay unique. So, first box, I got to kind of go back and pull out some best cards. I'm not seeing a whole lot at all. So if we think of our money back, I'm thinking I would pay like five bucks for these. So let's look at some of the greens, see if there's anything of value. We got one prism, but my oh my, this was uh, pretty rough. Is the DK Metcalf the best card? It's quite possible. Let's put the DK here. Tannehill, it's a rookie, but not what I'm looking for. Ugh. Ouch. That would be a total bummer if, well, Mac Jones, Tooney, hmm, well, it's a rookie quarterback. Well, I guess we'll just kind of go these five. I like the prisms. We'll kind of go with that. Hopefully we can improve on the next box. Let's go for it. Be nice to get at least a, a prism of one of the big names like Brady, Patty Mahomes. 
Then uh, being a Vikings fan, another Justin Jefferson, Dalvin Cook. I picked up a purple like this. I think that might be pink more. A purple Adam Thielen, so it's color match of his college uniform and a color match of his professional uniform. That's a Viking quarterback. He tested positive for COVID. And since Kirk Cousins isn't vaccinated, he had to go in COVID protocol. Well, I'm not even gonna put the purple down. Can't do it. We gotta get something better than that. So I picked up some Prism Draft from a friend of mine. So I have five or six of the Trevor Lawrence already. I think you got a hobby box. Just because it's Patrick Mahomes, you gotta put it there. So I do have some. I think it was a hobby exclusive Patrick Mahomes, not Patrick Mahomes, Lawrence Taylor, or <laughs> Taylor Lawrence, Lawrence Taylor. I'm all over the place right now. Najee, mm -hmm. Ben Roethlisberger. So I'm pretty sure this is my first Prism football box. Again, before the channel, I wasn't opening packs at all. Daniel Jones, wrong year. So I'm pretty sure this is my first Prism football box that I've opened. It's kind of reminding me why I haven't opened much. But it kind of gets you when it's a uh, Target red card exclusive. If you're thinking, man, I got to get in on this. It's kind of a bummer when you're putting down an Adam Thielen base card. Ouch. Love the cards though. Jamar Chase, well, put that down. Jordan Love. Ooh, what's that fifth card? My fifth favorite card, well. Hmm. Daniel Jones Prism, is that it? Stefan Diggs, not feeling that anymore. Ben Roethlisberger, all right. Mm -hmm. Here we got it, wow. If I had to pick one or the other, I would have to go this middle one. Got Thielen and Mahomes, and those aren't really worth anything. I just like the players. All right, last box. Let's end this on a high note, hopefully. So again, these are six packs, five cards in a pack. And obviously, like everyone else, you're looking for that Trevor Lawrence, but I would happily take a Tom Brady. I'm not picky. Beggars can't be choosers. Jamar Chase, that might be the best card so far, maybe. Looks like these are about one per box, so a little more rare. It's a good start. Surprised there hasn't been any really old players. It's a lot of current players, but usually in these products you see a little bit more of like the retired folks, like Barry Sanders, Emmett Smith. Not seen as many. Oh, Justin Herbert. I guess I'll put it down for now. Trey Lance, North Dakota. Got a gopher. This box is definitely looking better. So we're three packs in, and already, I think this box is better than the other ones. Miles Garrett. Oh, hey, hey, Trevor Lawrence, sweet. Maybe this is $15, so it's the price of the blaster. That's much better. The last box is by far the best one. So Prism Trevor Lawrence All-American. I'm happy with that. Mac Jones. Baker. Green. Drew Brees. All right, last pack. Hey, don't keep it under 10 minutes. Last pack, we got Drew Locke, Missouri. Chubba. Chubba? Hey, another Trevor Lawrence. This is definitely better. Boom. All right, two Trevor Lawrence. I'll take that. So two Trevor Lawrence, Jamar Chase purple or pink, 
Uh, probably pink. I wouldn't call that purple. All right, I'll take it. So $65 for all those. I think it's pretty close. 45, 50 bucks I would pay. Maybe 40 bucks. So not quite the total. The last box was where all the value is. Oh, that was fun, Rip. Thanks for watching. Happy collecting.